Hello everybody and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Hearts of Iron 3. Now this game just gave me a fucking heart attack. Uh, after I finished that last episode where I, you know, beat the Soviet Union and, you know, achieved peace and got all this 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 territory and I started reorganizing reorganizing my units right after I like the act of me hitting the end record button caused the game to crash on me. So uh thankfully the files were not corrupted, and that episode went up yesterday successfully. Thank freaking Jeebus. But unfortunately, I wasn't able to save the game before it crashed, so I did lose about 14 days worth of play, but that was, you know, nothing of consequence. Alright, to make things easier for me, what I decided to do is basically grab all of Army Group Center, everything that it's comprised of, and we're going to de detach that from this theater, and we're going to move it. We're going to do a strategic redeployment right over here then that's that that's an entire that's the entire army I think that's three armies no oh, why is that so you know that's got to fix itself in a second that should help the situation uh, but it's still gonna be a lot of redeployment like let's see um, the second panzer army that's gonna get detached and we're gonna redeploy this entire panzer army over here as well that's almost all of my tanks. Are we? Why is that supply? Co Why is that so low? There we go. There. That, that's the way it's supposed to be. We're not wasting production on reinforcements anymore because people aren't dying anymore, which is a good thing. We need. We're going to need a lot of. Oh, you know what? I did. You know what? What's gone now though is the fucking. Uh, let's see. We're going. We, we did garrison. And we did MPs. We did a bunch of these. Yeah, we did that. We lost that due to the crash. Uh, fifth or sixth crash. It's been a, there's been a lot of them. There has definitely been a lot. Let's take take a look at the air mode. Nobody's slapping me around over here, which is good. All right. So now we're just going to. Basically, attempt to redeploy the front. Let's see. Tenth Corps. All these divisions. I'm going to move you right here. Uh, what I'm going to be what I'm going to be doing here is uh, something I've really enjoyed doing in the past. Is I'm going to leave one Army Corps to cover three border provinces. And so what we'll do is we do two divisions, one division, two divisions like that. So in in, in eventual, no matter where the attack comes from. Um, it's it's a not it's not a really strong defense, but no matter where the attack comes from, we are going to have reinforcements nearby from the correct army corps to to be able to throw into the gap there. So we got three there. Those guys will take care of these three. You'll take care of these three down here. All right, and these guys. This well, this guy could probably get detached from where he is. But we'll figure that out as guys are moving around. We got to put. Uh, Japan's gonna attack the U.S. soon, aren't they? I think they are. Well, we almost got this one. One of the following must be true. Control... Man, I don't even know where any of those are. Supremacy in the east. I need one more of those. Hmm... I thought we had Gibraltar. Tangier, is that the one right across the strait? Yeah, it is. Okay, so mm, Spain, if you guys could join me, that'd be great. So right now we're influencing Yugoslavia to try to join me. So if we go to Europe... Bulgaria, Nationalist Spain... Yugoslavia, dr drifting towards the Axis. By a lot. Alright, so we should be... I'm not going to bother attacking people I don't necessarily need to yet. Oh, all these guys. I built all these... Th that's something, another something we missed, I think. Or got destroyed, whatever you want to call it. When we had our crash, all these infantry brigades getting finished and deployed. 
I'm just grabbing because I'm gonna. I'm, I'm, in the long run, I'm going to be f filling out all of these, so I'm just grabbing them and throwing them on anywhere, really, as long as it's a proper infantry division. Fill them all out eventually. Where's my fleet? Sevastopol? Alright, they're not needed in Sevastopol anymore. Right now they are going to be needed more... Let's redeploy them, rebase them over here. All this technology. We got, like, all the 1941 uh, technology done. And actually, we plan. I plan on doing this. So why don't we throw these guys in? 43, can it knocked off the list. But we, we can add on the 42s, though, because that's coming up. Ooh, you know what else we could do? Oh, that's production. I'm kind of low on production, honestly. Flying bomb. All these could get knocked off the list, finished them all. No, oh, we wanted that one on there, actually. Taking care of my tech these days. Well, I'm trying, just trying to get ahead of the game because all this 1942 stuff I'm going to need to put on there in several months anyway. A lot of stuff from 1942. It means a lot of upgrades. I don't know when I plan on doing my attack on the on the, the on the fucking UK here. I don't know when I plan on doing that. It's, I mean, it's gonna take me a while to finish up all this stuff. France, Italy, fire control system, Italy, light cruiser, really dealt with them. Oh, that was actually something I should do. Uh, do 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 do. Technology, capital. Nope, not there. Theory, La naval theory. Here we go. Carry tag, CAG duty efficiency. That's pretty good. Let's add that on there. There we go. Add you on there. Yeah, this is definitely why we need garrison. We're going to need garrisons left and right. As they are not exactly happy about the way uh, about the way things have gone. Oh, we Oh, you're coming up. That you you're, you're, you're you guys are working your way on over. So let's just let's do this. Let's tell you guys, you two to go here and you to go here and you two to go there. And the HQ just hang out right in that city where he is. Storming our beaches in Gibraltar. Uh, and we apparently have zero organization. What? Why? Why is there zero organization there? Is this the second... I, I noticed that I sent. Oh god, I'm annoyed. It's a short trip if you guys haven't noticed me getting annoyed. Three transports. Well, they're, they're basically just attacking anything along the way. All of my heavy, 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 heavy guys are getting. My heavy tanks are getting the additional artillery right now. I don't think those ships are going to get there anywhere close to being on time. I don't think it's going to make any difference. What are you doing here? Go get that guy. Now let's see. One, two... Nope. Okay, everybody, I guess. One... Two, one, one, two, and then the HQ can hang out right there, yeah. Yes, I know. I'm aware. A lot of production going on these days. Actually, it's got some of those ships almost finished.
What I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna have these guys convoy right down here. Stopped our diff diff why? That's not what I wanted you to do. I wanted you to influence the shit out of them. Hmm. Yep, I figured this kind of stuff would happen. Who's fast? You, you're, you're fast and you're closest. All right, these are some cags, not cags. Um, uh, with well, a close air support, casts is 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 is. Forgot I was. I for, even forgot I was building those. So that's um heavy cruiser, heavy cruiser. Light cruiser, light cruiser, battle cruiser, battle cruiser, light cruiser, light cruiser. Uh, ace aircraft carrier, aircraft carrier, more cruisers. I always felt like cruisers were super important in this game. You know what? I I feel like I should build some of that those SS units for the suppression and the mobility. Just thinking, kind of thinking to myself right now. Should probably try thinking out loud so you guys can follow along. Oh, the front is just uh, uh, reorganizing everything is just not something I terribly, terribly, terribly enjoy. All right, this is this is the second army. So you're, you're going to be in tra charge of this area of the front, so you need to move up here. You guys, you're going to take care of those three. You guys, you're going to take... So you're going to take care of one, two, three. You're going to take care of those three right there. Yeah, they're, they're, they're stacking the border, too. It's a huge, huge fucking border, too. My god. It's fucking massive. All right, so you and you are gonna move there. You're gonna move there. We're gonna go one, two, two, and one, two. Fourth core, Liberia. Why am I? See, the AI does things I don't fully understand. Like Liberia, of all the countries in the world, that's the one you're influencing right now. Here, and it's it's a big front, but I think I can, I'm going to be able to garrison it the way I want. I don't know how effective it's going to be. I'm going to need to leave. I mean, consider how many troops I actually have to leave over there. It's a fuck ton. I don't know if that's the the literal literal amount. I don't know if fuck ton is the literal amount, but it's a lot. Yeah, definitely need some upgrades. I got a lot of plane-related stuff in there. It's gonna be 19... It's def It's not gonna happen this year. It's gonna be 42 when I'm ready for this, definitely. Well, thank you for taking care of that. Can't wait for those fucking garrisons to be finished. I feel like some tanks need to get left over here, but I don't know how 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 much I enjoy the thought of not of not having tanks where I I really want them. Maybe like two tank cores I can leave, something like that. Not a not a ton. Like I have that entire Panzer army over there. Look at all these tanks just hanging out here. Yeah, there's gonna be some major reorganization coming pretty soon. Go there. The 501st Legion, that's a recently renamed guy. I feel like you should be about there. Alright, good. Now check out this stack. Whoop! That's an entire army group. I think that's an entire army group. Pretty sure that's what it- yeah, look at that. 70 infantry brigades. Two engineers? I, when did I put engineers in? Oh, that doesn't matter, I guess. 
he must have just been out of supply. That's all I could think of, is just he was out of supply. I really need Nationalist Spain on my side. No, they're not a neighbor. Bulgaria. A diplomat on route will arrive on uh, October 6th. What is he doing right now, I wonder? Seriously, guys, it's not like I don't have troops in the region. Yeah, well, these HQs don't really count, I guess. I really need to start building mechanized troops, or at least upgrading some of my troops to become mechanized troops. I could do that. Click on that mechanized. Mechanized. That's what's nice, is if you want to, you can just easily upgrade these guys like this. Super nice. If you want to. I think I messed that up. Yeah, there we go. Problem is, is that it takes a while. Well, uh, well, you can move here now. Uh, let's see. Production. Now they're going to be added in here. On the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, that's six IC a piece. That's a lot. What is it with the Liberia thing, AI? Seriously. The AI has got a serious boner for Liberia. Oh. Like, uh, I could do- I could do it on these guys, too. They're- they're attached guys. I can upgrade. No, I don't want to upgrade them to heavy armor. Alright, you take care of that one. You can do you there, you there, you there, you there. And where's my HQ? I like to move them back off the front when I'm on defensive stance here. If I can. Oh, I love how he sank, he sank the Royal Sovereign and the... <laughs> Maybe broken. Okay, completely expires relatively soon. Oh, thank freaking God. All right, what we're going to do is, uh, I like putting these in the VPs if I can. Because those ten can, can, can be hotbeds. Caucuses! You are caucuses is All right, um, Stalingrad is... Let's see if this is the caucuses. Stalingrad is here. All right, uh, speed five doesn't really do doesn't really do 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 me well. I don't think. I don't really like speed five. I wish national. I really do wish nationalist Spain was on my side. Oh, I've got to put this on 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 my control because they're just not doing what I want them to do. It does weird. The AI does. I, I don't know why. It does just. It does weird things. Yeah, Sweden's definitely gonna get an attack. Def Sweden's definitely gonna get some shit. The shit kicked out of them at some point. 21st of October, so that's just about now. There we go. I don't know what we were doing there. Let's influence nation. We're gonna, we're gonna do these guys too. I'm gonna influence. Oh, we're already influencing, and Yugoslavia influence. I kind of want. I want these guys to join me if I can get them to. So we're influencing. So if I go to Axis in Germany, influencing. Why do we influence Sweden? Ugh. AI, you're freaking more. It's never gonna work. Whatever. As I really would li like, if I could get a couple more guys on my side, that would free up a lot of... A lot of stuff for me. Now, where's that army? Here it is. And you're out of range of... everything? Okay. 
super out of range. So let's let's try let's try a little bit closer. See if that helps. Everybody's out of range of everybody, it seems. I just gotta get this border properly bordered. Oh, we must. Oh, yeah. We. I forgot we lost a division up here. HQ, you're gonna go right there. This guy's gonna take care of one, two, three. So you're gonna take care of that one. He's gonna take one, two, three. So we're gonna move everybody down one there. We're gonna go one there. We're gonna go two there. HQ, you're gonna go right here. Like you could, you could see, you're starting to form. You can see what I'm trying to do. They have decided the United Nations. Uh, more than 30 states, the nations fight in unity together and fidelity one another. Okay, what are you? Whatever. Day of Infamy! It, uh, November 3rd is the Day of Infamy. Alright, now let's take a look at the Allies. So the Allies, Great Britain. Is the U.S. in there? U.S. is in there now. Okay. So we have to worry about that. The U.S.'s Navy. And they do have a fucking Navy. Jesus Christ, do they ever have a Navy. Hmm. Just thinking still. Just thinking. Hopefully, it looks like those MPs are starting to have an effect. I need to get that. I think that once the organization goes up, they'll be better. I hope at least. It seems like they're having an effect. When was that? What, when will the next group be done? December fifteenth. Yeah, look at all this area. I like how there's random little spots that are just like, mm, fuck you. Huge swaths are perfectly fine, and then there's these little tiny spots that are just like, I don't really like you guys. Come on. I really like it. It's not cool. Not cool, guys. Like, I don't really want Yugoslav- I don't really care to have Yugoslavia for myself right now, but if, like, Italy and Hungary want to- want to do it, let's- we could- well, we could do this. We can send some guys down to help here. Yeah, let's do that, and let's let maybe- Italy and Hungary take care of it. I'm gonna say mostly Hungary, because I don't think Italy has very many troops right there. Well, Hungary does. Just trying to organize this a little bit. My Tiger Corps. Who is this? The okay. There's there's a there's a, a Panzer Corps as well. With all you guys there. Let's move you there and grab you. One, two, three, and then move you there. I think. I don't know if that's right. No, I don't think I did that right, but. Alrighty, we're doing okay. Just, just, just reorganizing, taking stock, thinking about what I want to do next. I mean, it's take, it takes a long time to really redo this, this, you know, fighting that one enemy for so long. It takes a long time to kind of reorient your mind. I'm glad that a lot of these extra Infantry brigades are finished, though. I like the extra hitting power they have, the extra combat capacity. Honestly, Sea Lion is not that difficult. I've never had that much trouble with it. Oh, Great Army. Leadership and Organization Regain. That's really good. 15 extra percent. That's pretty damn good. If I do say so myself, that's damn good. Oh, we actually almost have some cruisers done, too. Right now, the biggest drain is upgrading those guys to mechanized. That's a huge drain. Let's take a look at Revolt. Uh, sank some Greek ships. 
think we sank some American ships there, actually. Well, we're... They have an effect. They definitely have an effect. I'm, I'm gonna drop one of these and I'm gonna try to drop one of these in, like, every single victory point in city. And see what kind of difference it makes. I'm, I'm really happy that I've got all those ships constructed. Yeah, those are American ships we're sinking. Alright, for Sea Lion, how do you guys think we should do this? My... My thought... For Sea Lion... Is to drop... Is to basically take a port. Let's say take Plymouth. We take the port, and then we, we like, we stack up a ton of, of units, like, right here, Cherbourg. And then as soon as we take that port, we just move back and forth and back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. That's my thought. I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but that's what I have in mind. That's what I have in mind. I think this is a good, like, like, the straits here are a good place to just kind of camp out. God, I wish I could get National of Spain on my side. I know I've done, I, I, I say no, but I think I've done it before. Didn't I tell some guys to move? You know what? I probably grabbed everybody. The HQ, but not the other guys. That's probably what I did. I wonder how many times I fucking, whoa, we just finished a bunch of ships. I'm not going to add them to... My current fleet, I'm going to make a new fleet, basically. And we're going to merge all those guys together. So two heavy cruisers and four light cruisers. Excellent. Now what's next on the list here of things that are being going to be constructed? Uh, that's a... Oh, I know I have... All right, there we are. The nice and now. And the... Uh, Gobin? Those are probably going to get... Uh, that one. This one is probably going to get renamed. I know a bunch of people have been asking for ships to be named. And aircraft carriers. Aircraft carriers, mostly. I'm glad those garrisons are almost done. I'd really like to get another couple garrisons out there. Yeah, we just keep hitting them. Look at that. And we're not really losing supply ships anywhere. Well... Mediterranean, we're losing supply ships. That's where we're losing supply ships. And over here, it looks like, right there. We are losing some, but not a ton. I wonder where, where Turkey sits on this. Drifting towards the Allies. Let's influence them. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's influence these bu these buggers here. They're too neutral. They were born with a heart of neutrality. All right. Well, we could uh, we could we can try to do something about that. Ooh, yay! Uh, we're gonna throw up the, open the VP mode. Go boom. And we're gonna go boom. And we're gonna go boom. Sevastopol. And how about right there? All right. Uh, blanketing the area should help. And clearly it's going... They, they, need to get, they need to get their organization up before anything will happen. No, I don't want to upgrade any of that stuff. Yeah, I have to wait for the organization to, to get up before they start having an effect. But as I blanket the area, it should start getting better. I think. Yeah, yeah, it should. We're gonna go you here, you here, you guys there. There we go. And where are my tanks? Oh, they made it there already. Because Yugoslavia, I don't, I don't think these people are going to 
join me on their own accord. I think I'm going to have to force the issue. I definitely think I'm going to have to force the issue. I don't think they're going to, to join me. I really wish I could get Nationalist Spain at least, but I don't think these guys will. I was really hoping they would, but I doubt it. All right, well, I'm going to end this episode right here. If you've enjoyed it, just drop me those likes. Leave me the comments right down below. And if you're interesting, interested, oh my god, I can't talk today, in more Benjamin Magnus plays Hearts of Iron 3, just subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time.